I am Nick Lambeau, a medical student from the Netherlands and here at Melanoma Institute Australia to teach you about the HCDE guidelines for melanoma. Australia has the highest incidence of melanoma in the world and more than 11,000 people are diagnosed here every year. Although melanoma is not the most common form of skin cancer, it is the deadliest and is responsible for 75% of skin cancer death in Australia. However, the good news is that melanoma is often identifiable at an early stage, where a simple treatment may result in complete cure. Let's look at the five characteristics to help distinguish the difference between a benign mole and a potentially deadly melanoma. A stands for asymmetry. Benign moles are symmetrical in shape. But if you draw an imaginary line through the middle of a melanoma, both sides will be different and therefore asymmetrical. B stands for border. The border of a mole is clear and easy to determine. On the other hand, the border of melanoma is irregular, scalloped or poorly defined. C stands for color. A mole consists of one color and is usually brown. A melanoma could have a variety of colors or could be black, sometimes white, red or even blue. D stands for diameter. The size of a mole can range from a pinpoint to a few centimeters across. However, melanomas tend to be greater than 6 millimeters in diameter. E stands for evolution. Moles can grow a little throughout your life. However, melanomas may grow fast, change shape, color, elevation, or start to itch or bleed. The ABCDE guidelines are a structured and easy way for doctors, medical students and even patients to examine moles and help identify them at an early stage. By identifying suspicious moles using the ABCDE guidelines, early detection can lead to early treatment, decreasing the number of people who will die from melanoma. <laughs>